Holy shit, bro. It's 3.46 in the morning. I don't know if you guys can see that shit, but we're going to the airport. We're going to the airport. Don't wake up this early for flights, bro. This is just fucking crazy. All right, guys, we are at the airport. I hope you guys are ready for another video. We're traveling to go see Jack West in this video, so I'm super excited. You know, it's always a fucking good one when me and Jack get together. But before we start the video, this brio, brio, what the fuck am I talking about? I gotta be straight up. Obviously, I need to pay for this snowboard trip somehow. Sponsorship of today's video is Prize Picks. Prize Picks, I'm gonna set up, talk to you guys about it for a second. Minute. Minute, just sit it out. Help your boy out, watch the first minute of the video, and then enjoy the next 25 with no ads. No ads, yeah. No ads, no ads. All right, guys, so Prize Picks. Prize Picks is an online daily fantasy sports app that you guys can download to your iPhone. I'll pop up some pictures on the screen. This is my account right there. All you gotta do is pick your favorite players. So let's say you're watching football and you really like, who's my favorite player? Kirk Cousins, by far best football player of all time, better than Tom Brady, don't at me. But let's say you think he's gonna throw more than 275 yards. Kirk Cousins got a hammer. We know that's a lock, right? Lock means it's gonna hit. There's you over and over. I'll put up an example on the screen. So I'll pop it up right here. When that hits, you can get different multipliers. So let's say you hit six in a row, six right, all six that you selected, you get correct. You get a 25X multiplier. Let's say you get four. You get a 10X multiplier. Let's say you get two. I think it's three. If you guys want, I give out my picks on TikTok. It's Marco Cashed. I'll pop the TikTok up right here. I'm almost at 10K. I've been helping people make money. Obviously, you're gonna miss some, but I've been doing really well, and I'm happy to be a part of the team. I'm happy to be a part of Prize Picks. I'm happy that they you know, like working together and invited me out to events in Atlanta, and uh, I hope that I can continue to work with them over the course of the next few years. If you guys want, all you have to do is click the link at the top of my bio, top of the description of this video. It's Italian, code Italian on prize picks, more or less on your favorite players. You guys can take picks on anything. They have football, college basketball, college football, NBA, soccer, NHL, cricket, League of Legends, Call of Duty, they got all that shit. So if you guys want to play prize picks, sign up, follow along, let's get into the video. Hope you enjoy. We are with Jack West. What up, boys? You gonna post on YouTube anytime soon? Thinking about it. <laughs> Thinking about it. We're gonna we're gonna get a bunch of footage on the snowboard trip, and maybe Jack will make a comeback, bro. You know what we should do? I'm just I'm retired. I'm on vacation. What do you mean? Everyone's like, oh, you need to post. You need to make a comeback. I don't see it as a comeback. I'm just, you know, I'm I'm enjoying retirement at the moment. <laughs> Bro, it's like Tom Brady, bro. He's gonna come out of retirement. We gotta go. <laughs> we'll make a video just fucking shooting guns and working out. That'd be a good video. If you wanna shoot guns, we could. We gotta bomb home. Nah, we'll grab food. We can shoot guns another time, bro. Maybe we'll fucking. Maybe we'll bring the guns to the snowboard range. <laughs> and we'll play, like, fucking. We'll pick them off the mountain, bro. Pop, pop, pop. Like some Call of Duty. Yeah, dude. Dude. The modern, Did you ever play the Modern Warfare one back in the day when you were on the snowboard? There's no, the snowmobiles. Did you play that game? My parents didn't let me play shooting games because they thought I'd become too violent. <laughs> I guarantee you someone knows that. That, that, uh, what was, that mission was epic, bro. Yeah, my parents, my, my cousin bought me Call of Duty for the Wii, and I played the Wii Call of Duty for like one day, and I was like, I can't do this. The Wii? <laughs> the, yes. the, the Wii was the truth back in the bro, day, bro. Bro, my parents were convinced that I was like way too high energy to play shooting games, so they only let me play like Wii Sports and FIFA. Bro, Wii Sports had me sweating back in the day. Bro, bro the bowling boxing. and boxing? Me and my homies would be boxing like full on sweating. That shit was fun. Yeah, man, Wii Sports, if you guys don't like doing cardio, man, just download Wii Sports and fucking start boxing and playing tennis. You guaranteed. 
to lose weight, bro. <laughs> <laughs> That's our guarantee, man. If you fucking play Wii Sports, we guarantee you you'll lose weight, bro. It doesn't matter if you're 600 pounds or 60 pounds. It's coming for me. My dude took a leak. Oh! Trying to get smarter. He came to a bookstore. <laughs> I was gonna say, bro, this dude got me to a fucking library. But now nah, there's like a, a coffee shop and a little restaurant in the back that we're gonna go to. Oh, oh it is popping. That looks insane, though. I'm not gonna get it, bun? but it looks insane. What you get? It's a good old fashioned black coffee, baby. Thank you very much. I got a cold brew, bro. Gotta wash the cows. It's good. It's a good cold brew, bro. Is it pretty good? I'm gonna well, ask for like a little Seattle. splash. It better, it better be good coffee. Oh, it's money over there, bro. This dude brought me to a cat cafe. Getting in, it's a little hours. yellow one or orange. Okay, bro. They need to make a dog cafe. A bulldog specifically. <laughs> yeah, bro. <laughs> a ruby cafe, dude. <laughs> but uh, nah, if they had a dog cafe, bro, I'd be in that bitch every day. I'd be in there every day, bro. I'd fucking spend thousands of dollars on coffee. I'd probably have. 45 dogs. I wish, bro, I wish one day I can have enough money to just have a massive ranch in like the Carolinas or and just have 50, 50 dogs. dogs. bro, that's the dream, isn't it? And have my own like wolf pack, bro. That'd be lit. Bro, it's a crazy view. If you guys ever want to find Bigfoot, this would probably be the area you go. Bigfoot got guns? No, we got guns. Bigfoot just got, he just got big feet. He'll crush us. That would be even more terrifying if he had like an LMG. Bigfoot <laughs> walking around with a fucking- Bro, fucking Bigfoot has a rocket launcher and he's just fucking spraying down people coming to see him. I would love to find Bigfoot though. As long as he doesn't like fuck me up and kill me, I'd love to be able to like, even if like nobody believes me, just to know for a fact that I, I know Bigfoot's real, but to have validation in it would be sick. I feel like we would have caught him if he's real. You're right a now. doubter, bro. You're just I don't a even think I'm doubter. No, I'm not a doubter because I've like listened to stories about people on Native American reservations, and bro, they swear Bigfoot's real. So there's yeah. got to be some truth to it. Barefoot and skinwalkers, bro. Skinwalkers. Now, skinwalkers, that's one that I'm a little freaked out about. I'm freaked out about skinwalkers, bro. This isn't skinwalker territory, though. This is like. This is the fucking Bigfoot territory, this is bro. Bigfoot slash meth lab deep in the <laughs> woods territory. <laughs> bro, bro, the funniest shit I've ever seen was like, there's a thousand ways to die. These people had like a fucking meth lab in the woods and one of them like lit a match Blew up. and it Blew fucking up. exploded. Death by meth. Yeah, bro, you gotta have a degree to be making meth or some shit. They can't just be like, no one is that. Be careful what meth you take and what fucking steroids you take. Cause someone probably cooked the steroids in the same bathtub they made meth in. Yeah, it depends on what day of the week it was. <laughs> Tuesdays they cook meth, Wednesdays they cook test. All right guys, we're set up on the, on the Duramax, the diesel big boy truck. But we're about to go shoot some fucking guns. I got uh, uh, cowboy boots on. Yeah, we are on a dirt road. We're on a legitimate dirt road in the fucking boondocks. <laughs> He's all hyped on a dirt road. Yeah, bro. <laughs> Look at that. We got Bigfoot and the Denali. We got the Denali HD, brother. We picked up these pumpkin things. Here's one of the one of the glizzies but um there's the other one. <laughs> oh shit this is the boy. i haven't been shooting in a really long time i think since i was in arizona so it's nice it's nice to uh get out there and feel like a man again you know <laughs> yeah buddy all right guys over there i don't know if you guys can see that is where we're fucking shooting Working it, fuck, bro. It's getting foggy up in here, bro. It's, I can hardly see it over there. I told you, bro. It's far. It's a far shot. Fuck it, freezing. Your turn. It's 
see. Did I hit that bitch? I think it's my glasses. Oh, you think? No, here, let me see if I'll Bro. hit it. Right now, it's literally on the thing. Which one are you shooting? The right or the left? The one on the right. Oh, you're shooting it. Oh, I'm hitting it? You're hitting it. Hit the can. Try and hit the can. Oh! <laughs> Fucking money. Bro, I fucking murked that shit. <laughs> oh, yeah, we were fucking hitting that bitch. Oh, shit. You were right, bro. It's going right through it. I'm gonna, I'll shoot the can. I'm telling you, the red dot's on on this one. All I don't right. know about the scar, but this one... <laughs> Oh, he got the can! Oh. I'm gonna hit that fucking can. All right. Can, baby! Can, baby! <laughs> Gun safety class 101. I'm the most responsible Saw Holmes. you'll ever meet, bruh. What's up, Holmes? Maybe not the most responsible. <laughs> Alright, guys. We're about to head to the mountain, yo. Fit check, dude. Got the Supreme jacket. Shout out my Asians, bro. We made it. Rubes. Come here. Ruby, come here. What are you doing? What are you doing? Little Carhartt jacket. But, um... Yeah, we're about to go up to the mountains. Look at this shit, man. So fucking dope. There's something about the views that you get when you're in an area like this, man. It makes you really want to move out to the countries and just fuck off from society. That's what I did. <laughs> that is what Jack did. Dead ass what Jack did. But, all right, guys. I'm going to head up to the mountain. Switch you guys probably to the iPhone. Maybe a little GoPro ski or something. But... Bro, I love this jacket. Hardest jacket I own, bro. You guys can see some fucking fit pics in this shit for sure. Alright, guys. We're stuck on the fucking lift, dude. We're in that we're movie. We're the only ones, bro, in that movie. What was it called? I don't know. It wasn't called Frozen. It was like a... Something like that. Frozen, bro? That's the yeah, fucking... No, that's the Disney movie. No, they got stuck on the lift. It's the movie where they get stuck on... That movie's so stupid. Three, three people, bro. A dude... Two dudes and a girl, they get eaten by wolves. Good fucking movie, bro. You should watch that shit. But we are, in fact, stuck. So if you guys don't see a YouTube upload for me, or you do, I probably edit it on this fucking lift. <laughs> nice. Hell yeah. <laughs> Fuck, bro, my booty hole. Is it okay? <laughs> yeah, <I'm> <laughs> Alright, guys. It's the next day. I'm in this little German town, bro. It's called Levensworth, and it's so fucking cool. I'll show you guys, like, the downtown area, but I'm at Starbucks. I always go to Starbucks. Look at this, bro. Starbucks coffee. It's all, like, German-themed. All of the shops, all of the shops make it feel like you're in like some small, like 1700s German town. It's really cool. <laughs> yeah, guys, I fucking, I told, look at this building. Bro. <laughs> that in like the 1940s, they were like, yo, nobody's coming to this town. We have to close the town down. It's not making enough money. And some dude was like, why don't we just make it all old German town themed and be like a resort type people want to come visit. Bro, and that shit worked. This place is popping. It's funny, they had a town meeting about it. They imagine them just coming in and be like, fuck, does anybody have any ideas of how we could save the town? And the guy's like, hear me out. German town. And it actually <laughs> worked. Ruby. Hey girl! Yeah! 
little butt scratches. Jack left me in charge of his child, but yo, look at that view. All right, guys. Something I have not done in about five days, workout. We're going to the gym. We got pre-workout mixed up right there. You know the drill, Rise, Code Italian. Young LA, Code Italian. I was like, see, I put it in there, I was seeing if it went out. <laughs> yeah. What are we doing? We're paying the bill, just getting a little lift in. Gotta get right back to it <laughs> after we take a little vacation. I got like four days until my next snowboarding trip, so sweet, I can make a little bit of progress and lose it all. <laughs> Sounds like me at the casino, dog. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. Bro, last night, okay, so I bought in for, I'm doing this new th uh, thing on my Instagram where I buy in for every follower I have on Instagram. So I have 120K, I bought in for 1200 bucks, and I was all the way down to 25 bucks, went over to craps and ran up like 2K, went to blackjack and went to five and a half, and Jack's like, bro, come home, and I'm like, dog, I don't know, I'm feeling good, and then I ended up walking out with like 3780, so I was pretty stoked, but bro, it's up, down, up, down. All right, guys, you know the drill, always start with pull-ups, but I think we're gonna hit chest today. It's a nice gym, I'll give you a tour. Guys, I guess just don't follow the fucking sky, you know? All right, guys, Cowboy Marco activated. Bougie designer Cowboy Marco. Cowboy Tobias Castle. Oh, shit. We got a seagull and a... Uh, oh, shit. <laughs> a seagull and a fucking eagle. <laughs> Bro, look at that fucking eagle, Wait, dude. Feed that? Does this one eat? All right, guys, we're at some, like, animal park. Oh, my God, I'm zoomed mad close to my face, and I'm fucking hideous, dog. But, um, yeah, we got this, like, we're at this animal park. We get to go look at bears, and we get to maybe hold a goat, so I can hold a little version of myself. That would be pretty cool. I don't want to hit him. <laughs> All big little dog here. Oh my hey, god. Buddy. You're scary. <laughs> Bro, he got that fucking tongue on him, dog. 
dude. Howdy. What's up, little bud? <laughs> I wanted to pet him. Yo, this is wild. What does that mean, dog? Hey, you got your gudges. Oh, go, 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 go,